Hey there everyone, welcome to Technisha. In this Texel tip video, I will quickly show you how to set the amount of content you want to be printed on a single sheet in Excel. So let's get to it. Here you see a table of weekly sales data of a company from year 1995 to year 2018. You can see here that the table is pretty big and printing it can be tricky. So let's see what we would get by default. So if you wanted to print this table now, you would go to file, say print and this would show that it will take 6 pages to print this table. The options we have here is to go into portrait and landscape. So let's say you go into portrait mode and it goes to 8 pages. Let's say you wanted to do scale to fit. This would take the full table and print it in one sheet. Though this option prints the whole table in one sheet, in many cases it's not advantageous as the numbers and the font become really small. So what can we do to print this table in such a way which is legible to read and also takes less amount of space. So there are a couple of things we need to do. So let's hit cancel. First we need to set the rows and columns that we want to repeat in each sheet. This will ensure that we have the reference in each sheet. So let's go to page layout and say page setup. In this there is an option called sheet and here pin titles. This will ask you to mention the rows to repeat at top and the columns to repeat at left. So let's first select the rows we want to repeat it on top. That's row 1 and 2 and the columns we want to print on the left is going to be A and B. Say OK. Now if you go and select the print option, it still will have the same 6 pages but if you note closely the weeks and the year is going to be mentioned in all sheets. If we select portrait mode now we get up to week 47. Let's say now if you wanted to get all the weeks in one sheet, how can we do that? So let's go to cancel here and now you need to go to a tab called view on the ribbon and then select page break view. This will show you exactly what content will be printed per page. The beauty about this view is it is customizable. So let's say now that I wanted to put all the rows in one sheet. All I need to do is go to the dotted line, click it and drag it all the way to row number 53. There it is. So now you see that the page 1 will contain from weeks 1 to weeks 53 for the years. Now if you go to file and say print, there will be 4 pages of data and per page you will have the full weekly sales summary for that year. And when you scroll through the pages, the other years will be present. I hope that this tip will be of use to you. If you liked it, please subscribe to my channel. Till next time, ciao.